Hey, um, what I want to try to make here is a uh, ND filter for the camera of the Phantom quadcopter. This one, itty bitty lens. Because someone asked me to fly this stupid thing tomorrow and there's no time to order a, a filter cap that you can put on. So I got this uh, Koken, Koka, Koken. ND filter and it's uh, plastic filter glass that I want to try to cut out. It's an ND8 so I hope this will bring me down to be able to use a really low shutter speed and not something over a thousand. Um, yeah, so let's see if it's even possible to cut this to um, mill it. First I want to measure the size of this lens because it has this really uh, small border so I could actually cut, cut a circle from the from the filter and put it inside of the silver border thing here and then mill another piece that goes over it and kind of sticks onto the metal housing. So let's see. Don't want to scratch it. So it looks like 28 millimeters. Uh, since I don't know uh, what kind of stuff this filter is made of and I don't know if it will behave like acrylic glass or plexiglass. I think it'll be a good idea to start from the side, let the mach machine come from the side and not dive into the stuff. And yeah, since I only have one try, I want to play it safe, but I think I will try uh, cutting off a, a part of the filter. Um, maybe down here where it's labeled anyway just try how it behaves and then uh, let the machine mill the rest. Now I want to try to cut this little corner just to see how it works or how it doesn't work. So spin up the So um, I think it's shattered just a little bit. But what else can I do there to try it? So let's try this. fits right in there. Now I need to make some sort of cap that'll hold it down, hold it in place. goes my little ND filter holder. Um, it's not tight enough though. I used 
diameter of 31.5 millimeters but I guess it's actually 31 maybe even less so I think this will need some electrical tape and then it will stick on there I have this glue here, this is actually for acrylic glass mm. but maybe it'll work get rid of the rest of the glue slip right on there uh, you can see it's already heavy on the head now not sure if this will work really heavy so let's see if it gets mad at me for putting so much weight on its head Seems like it doesn't notice the extra weight, but we still don't know how it behave in in the wind and with fast movements. So yeah, maybe I can still cut some of the weight off if I cut it right here, but but it won't change the fact that most of the weight is in the front, so can't really change that. I wonder how heavy the ones are that you can actually buy 